Hey everyone! Welcome to the Dog's Genesis, the ultimate source of information on all things canine. Today, I'm going to be talking about why you shouldn't get a Dachshund. Now, I know this might come as a bit of a shock, since Dachshunds are so adorable and are one of the most popular breeds of dogs. But there are a few reasons why getting a Dachshund might not be the best choice for you. Before getting into the topic, we would like to ask our viewers to subscribe to our channel to stay updated with more exciting content. Your support means everything to us. Get ready for an engaging and informative video, so let's dive right into it. Do you think a Dachshund is the perfect match for you and your family? In this video, we'll explain why a Dachshund might not be the ideal pet for certain people, there are several reasons why it may not be a good fit, such as their need for exercise, their compatibility with children, and other factors. It's important to consider all of these when deciding if a Dachshund is the right pet for you. Reasons not to have a Dachshund 1. Dachshunds are stubborn and tenacious. These dogs may not be the ideal choice for those unfamiliar with owning a dog. They can be strong-willed and may try to take control of a situation, even if they have been taught obedience. Sometimes they will opt to do whatever they choose instead of following the commands of their owner. 2. They need a lot of attention. A Dachshund enjoys being around its owners a lot. On the other hand, an unsatisfied one will find its own ways of entertaining itself, normally leading to unpleasant and dangerous behavior. If you may not be able to afford enough of your time and energy to your pet, you ought to consider a more independent breed. 3. They are barkers. Certain Dachshunds tend to bark more than others, and although many of them can be trained to bark less, they will often bark at every minor sound from outside of the house. As one of our viewers has stated, these dogs are so reactive that they bark even when a squirrel passes gas from far away. 4. There will be accidents at home. Dachshunds are renowned for being hard to housebreak. In autumn, when the weather gets chilly, it is known as the home poop season by me. Most Dachshunds don't feel comfortable in the cold and wet conditions and will go out, come back in, and then defecate on the floor. Additionally, they are vulnerable to separation anxiety, which can cause them to urinate on the floor when left alone. Even though these issues can be remedied, it requires a great deal of tolerance and a Dachshund will never be completely potty trained. 5. They are not lap dogs. Many individuals make the wrong decision of buying a miniature dog thinking that they don't need much exercise. Dachshunds were bred to hunt, so they have a lot of energy and strength. Even though they can become accustomed to a more laid-back lifestyle, they require a lot of exercise in order to stay healthy, content, and at a balanced weight. Sure, they could be content sitting on your lap, however, they are not a lap dog in the sluggish sense. 6. They are rudimentary and have a high prey drive. Dachshunds may not be the perfect pet for a house that has a cat, but I do know some that get along great with their feline siblings. They can become overly excited when they spot a squirrel and can act quite silly by barking and lunging at other large or unfamiliar dogs. 7. They are prone to back problems. Roughly 25% of Dachshunds will have some form of intervertebral disc disease over the course of their lifetime, as it is a genetic condition. While there is no way to test for this condition, it is possible that a Dachshund may not be affected. However, some cases of intervertebral disc disease can be severe and require surgery, which may cost up to $10,000. Therefore, if you are not willing to take the risk or cannot afford the associated costs, this breed may not be suitable for you. I hope this video has given you some insight into why you shouldn't get a Dachshund. While these dogs can make wonderful companions, they require a lot of time, patience, and dedication so make sure you do your research and understand the potential risks before bringing one of these adorable little dogs into your home. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.